PlyoGrip by Valvoline Epoxy Repair Systems will produce undetectable structural repairs on SMC and fiberglass parts found on hoods, bumpers, and side fairings. The following PlyoGrip by Valvoline materials are required for structural repair of SMC and fiberglass. Fiberglass Reinforcing Cloth, Stock Number 8023. SMC Repair Epoxy Adhesive, 400 milliliters, stock number 8032. And Finishing Cream, stock number 8003. Refer to product literature for work times, cure times, and paint times. Both SMC Repair Epoxy Adhesive and Finishing Cream may be accelerated with heat if faster repairs are desired. Refer to material data safety sheets before handling PlyoGrip by Valvoline repair adhesives to ensure safe use. Panel Preparation Vehicles should be at room temperature before beginning any repair. Applying heat to the damaged area will ensure all moisture is out of the fibers. Place a piece of masking tape over the repair area to keep solvents from wicking into the fibers. Use wax and grease absorber before sanding the area to be repaired. Note, do not allow solvent to absorb into fibers. Grind the front side and open up the damage area. Round off the edges about one inch beyond the cracked area. Blow off with clean, dry air. Sand the backside with 80 grit sandpaper. Blow off with clean, dry air. Cut a piece of fiberglass reinforcing cloth one inch larger than the damage area. Note, two layers may be needed for extra support. Use SMC Repair Epoxy Adhesive for matting of the backside of the repair. Remove the cap of the SMC Repair Epoxy Adhesive cartridge. Retain the cap for future storage. Properly place the cartridge into the gun. Prior to attaching the mixer, dispense a small amount of adhesive to ensure both sides flow evenly. Attach mixer and dispense two inches for proper mix. Apply a generous amount of SMC Repair Epoxy Adhesive to the back side. Lay the pre-cut fiberglass reinforcing cloth into the adhesive using a spreader, saturating the cloth. Apply another layer of adhesive to the surface of the cloth and spread smooth. Smooth out air pockets with spreader. Heat cure with a heat lamp or heat gun for 10 to 15 minutes at 180 degrees Fahrenheit. Sand smooth any adhesive that squeezed through to the front side. SMC Repair Epoxy Adhesive is required for the front side. Build a pyramid reinforcing patch for the front side with SMC Repair Epoxy Adhesive and fiberglass reinforcing cloth with a minimum of three layers. This step is very important as the repair area needs to simulate the original panel in order to withstand expansion and contraction. This method will eliminate halos and bullseyes. Cut the first piece of fiberglass reinforcing cloth slightly smaller than the outer edge of the repair area. Cut the next two pieces so that they are smaller than the first. Apply a thin coat of adhesive to the repair area. Lay the smallest piece of cloth in first and saturate with a spreader making sure no air is trapped between the layers of cloth. Next, apply another thin coat of adhesive and lay the next larger piece of cloth in. Follow with largest piece.
apply a final top coat of adhesive and smooth out. Apply heat with heat gun or heat lamp at 180 degrees Fahrenheit for 10 to 15 minutes. Allow to cool. Sand with 80 grit sandpaper, cutting slightly lower than the surface of the panel. Dispense finishing cream onto mixing palette and mix until uniform. Note, static mixers are not used with finishing cream. Dispense onto mixing palette and mix by hand with spreader. Apply a final coat of PlyoGrip by Valvoline Finishing Cream and feather out into panel. Allow to cure for 10 to 15 minutes at room temperature or apply heat lamp for 3 to 4 minutes at 180 degrees Fahrenheit. If heat was used, allow to cool. Then sand with 180 grit sandpaper, working finer. Prime and paint per paint manufacturer's recommendation.